This is Contra, the remake, right? This is a remake of of Contra. It is a remake. Apparently, it's uh, it was by an independent company, uh, and then I think Konami allowed them to release it here. It was originally released a couple months ago, and then it got pulled because it didn't have Konami's blessing. Hmm. But it's back, and um, I bought the iPhone version instead of the iPad because I'm an idiot. <laughs> so this will just, give you a taste. Yeah, you, you get the point. So apparently, there's two versions. There's the HD version, and then there's the iPhone version. <laughs> they don't know about Universal Apps. So. No, they they haven't figured that out. But okay, so let's touch the screen and begin. There's no options. It doesn't look like daily login bonus. All right. Well, that's me. Oh wow. You have already collected your reward. Okay. What's mission mode? Bill Riser. Okay. Well, there's girls in this one now. You should gotta unlock them. Okay. We'll just do Bill. Doesn't say if it's two player or not. Normal. Arcade mode is just the straight, straight up. And what did I do? Mission mode. mode? Yeah, or, so, okay. or you did uh, the other one. Wow, I already got an achievement too. This Yay. is a training. Yeah, we'd skip all this junk. Let's rock. Oh, I should have done the tutorial. <laughs> <laughs> Is fire continuous automatically, or do you have to? It is firing automatically. Yeah. Um. You have a jump button there too. Oh, is that it? here we go. So the control is a virtual keypad, and it does take a little bit to get used to. But it's nice that they put the auto fire in there. That's not great for. The power-ups where you have limited ammo, though, right? I don't think there are any like that. No? In the, in the first Contra. Hmm. Now, you're a big NES Contra fanatic. Just Contra in general. I love the Contra games. So is this familiar? Does this seem like... This the... is so far a better-looking version of the arcade. Mm-hmm. Which is a good thing. Um... The controls are just a little touchy. As far as I know, there's no iCade support or any type of controller, but I guess they could always add that at some point. Let's hope so. So, oh look at that, so you have the trees blow around. So it's got little added graphic touches. Yeah, it's pretty much, uh, it looks a lot like what you would oh. expect from a, like a so-called HD remake. Yeah, right? That so many games are getting now. So yeah, so the, the game got pulled, and then uh, it came back, I would say like a month ago, or maybe two months ago, in the US store. And then it was a release for maybe a day, and then they pulled it again hmm. for, I think the reasons were it had an in-app purchase kind of system that didn't go over too well for mm -hmm. some reason. I don't know why it was different this time around, but um, they, so they, they pulled the game and then they tweaked it. So now this is the like version 2.0 and it seems pretty good actually. Once you get used to the controls a little bit. Mm -hmm. um, let's go to main menu. What does that do? Do you want to try one? Maybe I'll try arcade mode. Arcade mode. Let's see if you got the guts. Try a different guy. Let's see what... Land. Land's... Bean? Yeah, Lance Bean. I didn't know that was his last name. Codename Scorpion. <laughs> you gotta have code names when you're an action star. It's very important. So, I mean, like, the two-player option would be... I don't know how they would 
incorporate that, but that would have been a nice touch because Contra is a really good two-player game. Yeah, simultaneous two-player is pretty good. And you do get your choice of two weapons. Um, I think. I think I just messed you up. I don't know how or what, how that works. These guys always look like football players to me for some reason. <laughs> Is that what they remind you of? That's what it looks like to me. I can see that. I always think they're carrying like a sack of money or a backpack or something. Wow. Well, I mean, Contra is notoriously hard, so... Yeah, the, the touchy controls don't help in that regard. Well, the music's pretty good. They, they kind of did a little modern take on it. Sounds good. So I'm trying... Alright, so you have a high score on top, and you have diamonds that... I'm guessing... Oh, uh, probably the diamonds will allow you to buy things. Uh. Wow. Oh, yeah, so, you know, it says you can... Um, you have 15 diamonds and gold. Yeah, I guess to continue, you have to continue to... So this is very uncontra-like. So did you just waste my diamonds? I don't know, I guess so. I'm gonna have to buy more diamonds now. I just wanted to see what it did. You don't actually have to buy diamonds, right? I think you literally have to buy diamonds. No. No, not like... I don't have to go to a jeweler and buy diamonds. <laughs> I'm sure it's some kind of in-app purchase. Is it really? That seems... Apparently, yeah. I mean, I, when I downloaded the game, it says like this game offers in-app purchases, and there was a, a whole line of things you can buy, and one of them was twenty dollars. So there's one twenty dollar in-app purchase, mm -hmm. and I don't know what that is, but all right, we'll take the game over this time. Game over. Well, you made it to the, the boss level. <laughs> Didn't quite get there. So okay, so that was round one. Um, got some achievements, lev leveling up. Okay, so it's definitely enhanced contra, which is good because we've all played Contra before. And we, we did arcade mode, right? That was arcade mode just now. And you did mission mode the first time. Mission mode. So they don't give you a whole lot of options here. Is there a game center? Okay, so there is. And then this, oh, that's just the- Achievements. So what are these? Oh, okay, so now you- oh, here it is, 1999. <laughs> Super experience pack. Hmm. Why bother? And oh, see, I do have to buy diamonds. You don't have to. You could probably earn them in-game, right? I don't know. Oh, look at this! So now, if you want to buy, like, everything, it would be over $40. Plus the cost of the game. Yeah, right, because the game was... you got it for 99 cents? This was the, the iPhone was a dollar. The iPad one, I think it's like three or four dollars, maybe? Mm-hmm. I think it was two ninety nine when I saw it. Okay. Yeah. So, I mean, they're going to have in-app purchases. The game really should be free. All right, so that is Contra Evolution. Um, looks pretty good. And get it while you still can, because who knows when this game will expire in the App Store. Right, who knows, Konami might change their minds. Yep. All right, cool. Nice.